let's go ahead and get started, shall we? Remember, we're kind of traversing through the Crystal Tower. All right, so I think this is a boss rush gauntlet thing. I don't know. What do we know? Nothing. We, I think we're already here. Maybe. I don't actually know where we are. <laughs> like, oh, please, piece of cake. Don't. These shouldn't be um, uh, an issue at all. We're here to beat up some nerds. Got a drum made out of guys. Uh. We're kind of just wandering right now. Cause like, these two crystals are not really where I'm expecting them to be, to be honest. I already have a Moogle. I just want to make sure we have this frog. Don't have a wind or frog. Say fuck em. Victory! Man, we just gotta go talk to Choco Latte at some point then. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Power's just obnoxious on top of obnoxious on top of obnoxious. Like, what the hell? Have we even been here? Like, I can't tell if we're like going a good way or a bad way. Also, all these ambushes are like the worst. It's making me want to just turn off the freaking encounters. Because a Good damn fuck. Yeah, that's gonna take us to a teleport, so. Let's see where this takes us. If I have to go back to where we already were, I'm turning off uh, encounters just to run there. Because. Oh. 
These aren't even hard enemies, they're just annoying. You know? Sorry, and water. this might not end well for you. Honestly, I just didn't want to even deal with them. I'm just like, nope, let's just leave. <laughs> just like, I'm sick and tired of all these encounters. Just to get through this area, I'm just... <laughs> I'm just having none of this, yo. I don't care. <laughs> right now, because this place is just obnoxious and I have no idea where we are, when we are, or what we are. I know what we're supposed to do, but like, how do you encounter it? I don't know. That's a random fight. Like, am I actually doing the stuff I'm supposed to do? I don't know. <laughs> huh. So maybe I shouldn't have done that. I don't, I don't freaking know, dude. Sorry, but this might not end well for you. Why does it have so many heads? It's the wind locks. It's 
Tima. Astrius. Unimprisonable, I assume. Yeah. And Astrius. All right, you are weak to ice. You are weak to win. Great. We should be able to just auto battle this the rest of the way down. Nice. We did Easy. It. Good job. A lot of armor gems and several mementos. Two mirages, we just need one more pair. Water and fire. More than the likely. No, not that. This is what I want. All right, let's do a quick old save skis. Let's look at some of these guys' uh, Mirage Bards. that whenever we need so we can put this dude away um I'm gonna grab sister tar because we can now transmorgify you into that thing asterius Sister Tar, that can go to Minotaur. Cool, nothing else interesting here. Nice mirror jewel. Right, get rid of you, and let's throw in somebody else who has some transformations, of which Skull Eater does technically have one. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's that. Of which I don't think we can get, can we? Yeah. Still a mystery. So I will actually keep you on here for now, Mr. Nut Eater. Mr. <laughs> Nutter Butter. Anyway. <sighs> oh, I think you're only on here because I need the zappity zap zaps. Yeah. Okay. So I can ignore the death seizure. Seizure? Searcher. The death seizure. I think you're only on here because I need a fly. No. Well, you are on here because I need Flutter, but also because I need your eyeball. Which we have not learned yet. What about you, sir? 
why are you getting here? Because we're trying to learn your evolution, which we actually have access to. You just haven't had enough, uh, SP for me. Nah, you got King Bomb unlocked. I mean, could be useful, but not necessarily necessary, so. Uh, don't need you. Hold on, what am I missing on this? Oh, I think you have one more uh, evolution. Yeah, have not accessed that yet. It's 29. Oh, hold on. Isn't that what the Death Searcher can do? Yeah. Oh, that's right. We still need that. That's why. Okay, this can go away. You can go away, good sir. Black Knack, we still have you we need to get. Um, that's for later. That one's completed. No, it's not. Why aren't you completed, good sir? Oh, I think I might now. <clears throat> no, I got that unlocked. No, that's unlocked. Why aren't you unlocked, good sir? Why is your last one not unlocked, I should say? Old skull, switchy to that one. One of you has something I need. Which one of you has something we don't? Hmm. <sighs> okay, let's try Death School. Maybe it's Death... It's fuck, not the stack setup. I don't care about my stack setup because it's not going in our stack setup. We've got an amazing setup of stacks, yo. Not actually amazing, but good enough. Uh, wait. No, we have Death Princess, though. On Dead Princess, I should say. Do I actually... Ha oh, I probably have to actually, like, transform into her for it to actually be a... Unlocked. Which is weird. Because there's, like, a... F Official, like, death princess, and there's like, oh, this is a death princess instead of a death princess. Or undead princess, my bad. Because, like, this one. Uh. Oh, no, never, never mind. Uh, because some of them are, like, unofficial due to the fact that it is, um. Uh. Due to the fact that they are unique souls, that's what I wanted. Unique, certain unique souls, um, you can't transform into them. Due to the fact that they are unique souls. Okay, I have Nightmare, can't access that yet. I have to regen your jewel. Nightmare. Mithril Giant. We still have to beat old Biggie. Alright, let's look at your... Shit. I'm still missing your other transformation, dude. Which to me is a little weird, but... You have everything I care about unlocked. How about you? I can give you better accuracy, that makes sense. I mean, I could have grabbed Holy, but whatever. 
Um, can't get anything from Tama yet because Tama just doesn't have it yet. Tama cannot transform yet, which is a little sad. But also, we don't have a reason for Tama to. Oh, I need two more for Diamond Dust. Ah, oh, fudge nuggets. Oh well. All right. Let's save because we just did a lot of shit. Okay, and now let's do the other side. Now that I know this is actually the correct way to go, I feel silly. But it is what it is. I'll get you later. No trouble. Like, sorry, mate, I reduced your HP, it just wasn't good enough. I don't understand that one. Like, do you have to reduce it to within a certain percent? Or like, how do that work? Never fully understood that one. Like, I'm pretty sure I've already reduced the HP, but. so bad. Nope, not bad at all. In fact, it was good. So good in the neighborhood. Don't let your guard down just because we're strong. is us. Victory is we. We can be your victory. Doodly dee, doodly do. I said kickly blee. What? I'm ready when you... I don't know. Sometimes I feel like it's just super necessary for me to apologize for whatever. Coming out of the hole that is my mouth. That was a good fight. Predictable. Ah. Oh. Either way, d d d d l e d. Sorry, but this might not end. Probably should put old unicorn away soon because unicorn's not really giving us anything new at the moment. But we could be fine as well for now. We'll see when we get to the next uh, prism nope. case access point. Like, sorry, Mr. C, but your powers don't work here, as you can see. Sorry. 
sorry, but this might not be... Good fight. Good job. Well, those are some enemies, all right. Can't, can't do anything new with you, so we can ignore you for now. Look at our C Sarpanti. Are sitting done. So, what am, am I gonna do? Simple. Access the prism case. First, I'm gonna turn you into a regular sea snake. Second, I'm gonna grab the unicorn and find our bihydras. Or our trihide, I should say. Takes us back to try high. Cool. Doesn't look like you have anything else left in your uh, line, I think. Yep. You're completely done, try high. That's done. That's done. They're done. By Hydra's missing something? Oh, yeah, you are. Okay. Okay, just straight down the line. That, that, that's gonna be easy for Mr. By High. Let's take a look at your Mirage board. Can't do that. Can't do that. Water, mirror, and jewel. Let's go. So, can I just run? let's make this quick? Nice. It is the Crystal Tower, after all. So, makes sense why you would like it. You know who's stronger? Us! Us. Maybe. Maybe. Is this the keep 
Jasper of the Waterlock? <laughs> you fools! These dark depths shall be your, your tomb! Tama, you okay? Oh, he just looked like he the wanted to say as much. That's all. What? <laughs> the Kraken! This is probably what the Mind Flayer evolves into, most likely. But I could also see it being not. I'm honestly surprised this is Buer and not um, somebody else, but you know, whatever. So, it's water we need to deal with and thunder. So, I think what we'll end up doing is just focusing. What? Whatever. <sighs> Focus that. We have defeated the Kraken! Forty-five percent chance to resist slow. Are you kidding me? There we go. Should beat it just by smacking it across the eyeball. I was gonna say across the face, but then I realized that face is just a literal giant eyeball. Alright. Take this! Death by electrocution. <laughs> Alright! Predictable. The last one. Yeah. Woohoo! Woohoo! Right. I think this could be the it. The final showdown. It's the final showdown. Ba na 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 Fucking twenty two, bruh. Twenty two, bruh. Let's see if this giant sea snake. Nope. Giant sea snake does not turn into the guy Hydra or a uh, Kraken. Crack a lacken. It's a lacking a Kraken. 22, bruh. Alright. Okay, yeah. 
Nothing about the sea serpent or sea snake turns into cracky yacky. I always said thing, hold on. Yeah. I wanted to make sure. I didn't think it would, but you never know. Blood eye should turn into that giant buell. Bueller. Kind of keep you on still. Uh, Skull Eater should be fine to get rid of now because now he should a thousand percent reach where I need him to. Yeah, he is right here. So I'm going to get rid of you in exchange for our tentacle boys. Squidraken. I have a mind player in here. Is it a higher level? Oh, there you are. Yeah, it is. Well, whatever. <laughs> oh shit, it's got a double Evo? Let's go. I think it's kind of weird that uh, it turns into a crack, the Mind Flayer turns into a Kraken and not the Squid Racken turns into a Kraken. It's the Mind Flayer that does. Little, little odd in my opinion. Okay, can't do that one obviously. Can't do that one obviously. Could do that one though. Go access our prism in case. Uh, turn into a squidraken, and now we take a look at your mirage board. Though to be honest, I can already guess it's gonna be. Just turns into a mind player, and then can't do that one. Okay. I mean it's. Slightly expected, I'm also 100% sad, but it is what it is. So anyway, let's save and then see what's through this door. Oh, hold on. Ah, one level away from a new mirror jewel for both of them, let's go. <sighs> story time, story time, turn off cam, it's story time. they were the keys that open it but what could a barrier this strong be trying to keep out or in guys let's check it out okay okay all right gonna leave the cam off because we're most likely going into another cutscene chapter 20 the crimson, the crimson prophecies, prophecies end, end. Huh? Whoa, check. 
check it out. This place is... It's the beautiful. It's the Something beautiful. Something about it makes me... Feel safe. Uh, yeah. You think Mom could be here? Maybe. Let's find her. Federation? Federation? How very quaint. Is that the tale Seguarides has been spreading? So be it. Then you have found me out, boy. I am king of the Bahamutian Federation. Brandalis. Brandalis. He's the one. The villain behind it all. In the cage there. Is that loose, Farna? What did you do to our mom? Is that why you have come? What? Tell me why you have traveled all this way. You have our mom, right? Get her back! Yeah. Start by setting her free. Yeah! Naive fools. <laughs> Still. <laughs> I will play my part. Fools. This place, this guy. Why do they feel so hauntingly familiar? Rain, you have to snap that out of it and stay focused. Yeah, she's right. Since when are you the one to space out at a critical moment? Uh, uh, be quiet. I'm paying attention, okay? Good. Be a fast boy. little damage though, but so. I know. Thank <laughs> you. 
How much HP has he got? Like 13. Fall here very quickly. too easy for a final boss, which means that's not a final boss. He was playing a part in the play. Bet those nutcases who sided with the Federation are gonna sweat. <sighs> oh, right. Rain, come on. We gotta bust Mom out. Oh, right. But how do we open it? Uh, you again? Activate it. Huh? Sorry? Only Mirage Keepers are permitted to use that mighty portal. The Ultima Gate. With the Ultima Gate. The power of the crystals becomes yours to control. Opening a mere cage would be no challenge at all. I think I'm starting to remember. The portal, it started to shine. And then the cage appeared. Then that means this isn't your the first time seeing it! Yeah. It's hazy, but I've seen this gate before. Then you know what to do. Use it. Wait! Who are you? Anime! <laughs> she just rips off her cloak. That doesn't tell us who you are. Let's reminisce later. Save Lady Luce. So then, that really is our mom in the cage? Well, okay then. Let's hurry up and activate that Ultima Gate thingamajig and bust the cage open. R right. You couldn't see, but I had squinty eyes throughout that entire cutscene. More the anime. Come <laughs> 
The prophecy has ended in crimson. <laughs> Mom! Uh, huh. Suspected. <laughs> what? How can this... Ridiculous piece of theater, but well done. I commend you all. You may dispense with the illusion now, Ewain. I share that sentiment. Should we do this again, you will keep your prophecy more concise. <laughs> but you cannot accuse me of excess. Every step was necessary to the plan. <laughs> Tell me, what of the soul crystal? How much of the populace have we harvested? If I had to offer up a guess, then just about four souls in every ten. Is that all? After a whole century? I have been selected. And discreet. With Champions Awakening again, we're lucky to have pulled off such a feat. Heard that name the Order of the time. Circle. Were we acquainted in those ages past? If so, she would have served our enemy. Uh, then you know what comes next. We shall finally bring the Cogna into this world. We don't even know what's going on! <laughs> More anime! <laughs>
Well, that's intense. A giant robot? Man. Well, that's intense. I'm here. Sorry I'm late. Tatus! I love how they were more useful than the two main protags. They just stood there. The champions have rallied here to try and intervene before things go awry. Too late. The Cogna have passed through the portal. The fateful arrow has been loosed. Rejoice for the end of an A world? No! The beginning of something greater is now upon us. Is now upon us! Jesus. It's time to go! Go how? Jump down! <clears throat> They're here. Come on! Let us take care of them! Okay. Thanks. Mon! You get our sister! Uh, okay! <laughs> They so small, how they so mighty. I mean, lightning makes sense. Lightning is just a goddess. So. Canonically, lightning is a goddess, but. We're really doing this? Dude. Jump already. Well, of course, in every regard that matters, which is all of them. Don't you know? Couldn't have timed that better. 
I hate gravity. <laughs> it's oh, a good thing I actually caught you. Whoa, the lass in glasses. Hey, we meet again. Wait, what did you call me? Oh, uh, Captain Ferris called you that once. I think he's just mimicking her. Yep. Who asked that pirate? Anyway, we never did get to thank you. You were so helpful when we... Hmm? Well, I don't want to sound ungrateful. Your fast craft did get us to the low seas, but now whenever I hear rushing water, I remember what it was like almost dying, and... Yeah, you really scarred me for life. Oh, oh yeah? Well, why don't you tell me about it inside? Just tell me about that later. <laughs> oh. Do, 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 do. Hey, it's the Academy. Whoa, check it out. The Sea the Academy. Boat? This place is Choco Bacious. Choco Bacious. The first time I saw it, too. This is it. Home base for the League of S. Balam Garden. Balam Garden. It is Balam in game, not Balam. God damn it. There we go. It's like my game just froze. What? The entropic power intervals just won't be able to generate enough pyroclasmic energy for me to... Hey! You there! Come here for a second! All right! You there! Of course! Just as I thought! That restless look in your eye! You've journeyed all over the place, correct? I've been looking for someone like you. Can you do me a favor? You wouldn't happen to have any spare bomb fragments on you, would you? I have a lot! Them, I'm afraid my research here is at a standstill. Take this. Wow, you're a lifesaver. No, I'm not a candy lady. Tama, why are you floating over there? Tama, deep in thought. Tama thought time. Here, help yourselves. Here, help yourselves. Uh. Guess who? Welcome to. Choco Boco Bye now. Mm -mm. Do, 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 do. Wait. The girl without a name is not here. But if the girl without a name is not here. Wait. Tama's gone too! Tama! What will I do now? I don't know. I'll figure it out. Mm. 
Huh? We can't go anywhere else? Hey, you don't think... Tama? Uh, Tama? Hey! Tama! Tama, 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 Tama! I knew it. As long as Tama's mind is wandering, we won't be able to activate these gates. Dude, really? Why don't we just give her some time? At least we can still get back to Balam Garden, right? All right, then, fine. Let's head back there and keep exploring, then. Well, we can go to the Coliseum, too, but... Well, I know that you two have been through a lot recently, but why don't we start out by sharing our intel? Yeah, probably. Everyone's on deck, know. except the injured. This way. Oh, yeah. Do you know how Alan is doing? She's sound asleep down in the infirmary. I talked to Dr. Katawaki. Her diagnosis is that Alan is suffering from severe exhaustion. That's too bad. What about Yuna and the summoners? Same thing. They were forced to use their powers against their will. It took a lot out of them. Same goes for Titus. He won't wake up. Titus, is he okay? He took a beating, but they say he's gonna pull through. You know, he's pretty tough for a scrawny guy. In fact, Titus might be the only reason we were able to get to the summoners in time. You know that winged knight? I found Titus fighting her. He told me about the summoners. So we went to go save them. Right. And once me and Squall got word, you all showed up to bail us out, huh? It's a really good thing you did. Now you can help us fill in the blanks. Bahamut, did you figure out who they really are? And those weird mirages he called Cogna? What did you two kids do back there? Oh, uh, it's funny you should ask. We don't know what happened either. But what little we do know, we'll tell you. Wow. Then I guess the only one with answers is your sister, Alan. Excuse the interruption. I have new intel from our liaisons across Grimoire. Oh! Shulk! What's the story? You should have a look at this. What... happened? Well, those new mirages called Cogna have been taking over wherever they show up. For the most part, at least. For the of most course. part? What do you mean? Our reports say that towns belonging to the Federation were assimilated right away. But the places that have been resisting Federation rule have managed to keep the Cogna out so far. However, other threats have arisen. What? There have also been multiple sightings of the Dyad servants. Sorry, who are the Dyad servants? A century ago, the demon Dyad plunged Grimoire into an era of chaos. The Dyad servants were mirages that carried out most of the Dyad's dirty work, right? Uh -huh. So you're saying the servants are back after a hundred years? That appears to be the case. The Cogna have given them a chance to begin their reign of terror all over again. Hey, Vaughn. I think that we saw them. One came out of the crater where we fought the bomb. Another flew out from underneath Figaro Castle. Huh? Wh what exactly are you getting at? Are you saying we caused that too? We might have set them loose by accident. Dude, no! Dude, I'll say this. No. We need to take action now. The League will get to work with our agents on the ground. At any rate, it might be a while before Alwyn wakes up. Why don't you guys get some rest? If she's really your sister, make sure you talk things out. Lightning would know what happens when you don't talk to your sister. Dude, you don't say that. <sighs> oh, my eyes are killing me. 
Maybe I've been working too hard. But I can't stop until I've... Oh, you there! Your timing is perfect! Oh, Do you, you there! Extra eye drops you yes, I have eye drops, lady. Up, take this. I've cured your eyeballs. Sorry, guys. I need to get back to the control room and handle this mess. Look, I realize that you two are probably trustworthy. But the League does have its rules. Until you get clearance, restricted areas like the infirmary are off limits. If you want to explore, keep it to here in the lobby. Okay? Catch up later. Okay? Uh, so basically, she doesn't trust us at all. I mean, can well, you blame her? You can't blame her. Ha! <laughs> okay, so what do we do now? I'm worried about all our friends. We really do need to talk to Tama. Yeah, that's for sure. I keep calling her, but she just doesn't show up. I don't think she plans to leave Ninewood Hills. Come on, why don't we go see if we can cheer her up? No need for pleasantry. Honestly, I love seeing Balam Garden like this. It's so nice. So good. I really think Aid is very underrated. Tama nama nama na 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 na. Bum. My goodness, mm -hmm. what's with these especially long faces? Oh, I'm glad you're here. Seraphie, could you go get Tama for us? You want Tama? Funny you ask. She's been floating around like a terrified marshmallow ever since she got back. Let the pretty pixie handle this. Let the pretty pixie handle this. Hey, Tama. Huh? Tama? Tommy Tom? Answer me. Tommy Tom. <sighs> How dare you ignore me, you puny fluff butt! I am going to... Wash! You're so good! <laughs> Tama got I Tama walked. Tama like you ask. <laughs> Seraphie, one the day I will destroy you. Tama, can we talk? We just really, really need to know what happened. <sighs> Thanks for the reminding me. This is no time to go the gaga. Those Cogna the Night Summoners seriously bad the news. Cogna? No way. Yes, the way, and we have to stop them. Uh, time out. Before we go any further, Tama, what's a Cogna? They're horrible bad things completely beyond the description. Well, uh, maybe you should try anyway? The Cogna are living machines that thrive on destruction. They have laid more worlds to waste and there are stars in the sky. And that's not a poetic exaggeration. What? But that's nuts! They're almost like a disease. It's not that they're all strong, it's that they never stop growing in number. Once they manage to invade a world, no one can stop them the ever, not even in a crow herself. Then what about the knights? Are they, like, Cogna Masters or something? Something the else. They call themselves the X-9 Knight. They're a horrible order who they wander from the world to world and leave chaos in their wake. Which leads to the question, why, why I, I suppose. suppose. Yeah, why? But if they were the Order of the Circle, then I think I know the why. Whoa. Did you say the Order of the Circle? I'm afraid the so. Bad news? Me and the Seraphie have a history with them that goes back more years than I know how 
counted the count, there are arch, 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 arch nemeses. Arch, arch, <laughs> arch, arch. So that's who was pulling the strings. But that means they won't rest until... Until the every last world is destroyed. They're filled to the gills with ill the will. With ill I'm the will. I'm still not sure I get it. But basically you're saying grimoires and hot water. Is that the idea? The water's so hot it's almost the steaming. And if you think it will end So hot the it's grimoire, almost steaming. So it's coming. It's not Is hot. The hills in danger too? That wouldn't even be the tip of the iceberg. Oh no. No, no, no. We're not talking just one or two of the worlds. You see, we're the part of a whole Googleplex of worlds. A Googleplex? What is that? Like a thousand? Dude! A thousand? Actually, a Googleplex is ten. To the tenth, to the hundredth power. A million worlds? <sighs> we can work on your math skills some other time. I need to get one thing straight. The reason those things got into Grimoire? It's our fault, isn't it? Huh? Um, the maybe, I think, yes. So, basically, we've put Grimoire and other worlds in terrible danger. No. No, that can't be true. It is. We messed up. Those guys in the armor, they used us. They invented a false prophecy and tricked us into opening the Ultima Gate. Mom was just the bait. <gasps> Would you cut it out? No way, dude. Hey, hang on. Anna Crow is the one who said to collect mirages to find our family. If she hadn't let us on, then... Maybe... she's... one of them. No way! Absent the positively, no way! Huh? Oh, well, yeah, after all, Anna Crow would never, ever lie. All right, then. I guess I'll let it go. <laughs> so, like, why'd they pick us? How come we were even able to do something like that? I was... The hoping you would know. Um, if you're going to ask the someone, you should ask your big sister. You might be right. Let's return to Balam Garden and go talk to Alan. Alan. I keep on saying Juan. Juan? Huh? Uh, oh. Alan. Yeah, I guess she might be awake. Everyone's so sad. Bow. Is the girl with no name here yet? Oh, she back. Hello. What now? Which champion would you like to awaken? Look how cute we are, just smiling up at her. Oh, and now we're, we're below her tea table. She's like, so hello. Hello. I'm trying to look at you. Snow's on the prowl? Oh, God. Oh, wait, no, we already did this one. I was just like, ugh. Oh, can we do this yet? Ooh, we can't. Oh, no, we can't. Lame! Fine. Back to Silver Park we go. Park made of silver. Yah, 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 yah. Uh, now we can go anywhere except for uh, Saronia Harbor because it got blown up. Quistus? Were you about to call her Quistus? Sorry, but Quistus made it very clear that I can't let you. Okay, whoever made these games do not know how to pronounce things. Her name is Keistus, and it's Balam. Dear God. I'm about to flip someone off this goddamn ship. Hey there, Alwyn. Tell me one thing. Your past. 
Do you remember any of it? No, not really. Afraid not. Right. Of course. If you did remember, there's no way you would be talking to me. But I do remember you're my sister, Wen. She does. But I don't. So then, what will you do to me this time? Do to you? But when those knights were holding you prisoner. Stop. Huh? I don't know you anymore, so don't call me that. But when? Enough. Okay. I was a prisoner for a very long time. But it wasn't the knights. Well, who then? You ought to know. And why should I bother to help you? Figure out the obvious. You have to remember. For Lady Luce. Our mom? Is she here? Is she still alive? Yes. They're here. Lady Luce and Lord Rorik. Rorik? Her <gasps> dad? Then mom and dad are both okay? Where are they? But you know that too. Where they are. What they're doing. We do? Are you sure? Alwyn. Are you one of the bad guys? Me? One of them? You must be joking! But... You went around in a mask, tricking us. <sighs> Enough. Say no more. I just don't want to hear it. <laughs> Siren! You bring nothing to this world but pain and chaos. Leave now. Go back home and never wake from your sleep again. Your mother and father. I'll save them. Uh, gosh, bomb it. What the honk is her problem? She didn't tell us anything. No, but you heard what she said about mom and dad. They need to be saved. Huh? Oh, yeah. I guess she did. Okay, but what do they need saving from? I don't know. Hey! What's going on? Did you see that mirage? Where's Alwyn? <laughs> Where's Alwyn? <sighs> that explains what happened. But then, what are you two going to do now? I'm not sure. I know, this may sound a little selfish, but... If you don't mind, maybe you could help us fight off the Cogna that have appeared across Grimmoor. We need more manpower. As much as we can get. Sure. Huh? Whether we were tricked or not, we're still the ones who brought them here. We have to fix this. As long as we have the power to do it. Yeah, you're right. Besides... <sighs> helping the League out with operations means... Gathering mirages and getting stronger. If Seraphie and Tom are right, and we can trust what Enacro told us, then we ought to keep going. Let's collect mirages and find our family. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Great. Okay then, the airship. We'll let you borrow it. The skies are yours. Go on out there and help wherever you can. But we can teleport anywhere we want, whenever we want. We have Eunice Champion Medal, Terra's Champion Medal. Nice! It's good that we're helping the League out, but remember, we need to round up more Mirages. Tama, these Cogna things, can you tell us more about them? They look powerful. Like Mirages, some of the Cogna are strong and some not so the much. Then some again, not so the, the tough ones are really the really the tough. In fact, some of the Cogna have such powerful defenses that regular attacks that won't even leave a scratch on them. Dude, what? How Dude, are we supposed to what? stop them then? Remember, we're not the only ones out there fighting. There's Cloud, Squall, Lightning. We're all gonna have to learn to help each other out. Right. Good point. Yeah. Good point.
Chapter 21. Chaos. Chaos in Grimoire. Okay. So Actually, I think I had wrong information. Well, I don't think we're even close to being done. If we can track down done. Cloud, Squall, and Lightning, they could probably use a little help with the Kopna. Right, but where are they? Cool. Oh, we need Aww. more intel. Oh, for that the kind of stuff, you should definitely consult with Seraphie. Hang on while I go in to get her. Yeah, hi. So I suppose you're gonna make me break out the old rumor radar for you. Rumor radar? Rumor radar? Oh, that's my secret power, hun. It lets me instantly snap up every bit of gossip within my threshold. Oh my god, she sounds like a like middle-aged woman. basically only amounts to everything. <sighs> Whoa, now that's cool! My rumor huh? radar. Is it cool? Well, I'm no expert, but I'd say it is. Whoa. It's just a sucker mom. I thought I'd never be one of those cool pixies. Well, you need to know that you picked up facts instead of rumors. Thanks for that reminder. Uh, well, so do you mind trying it? Yeah, sure. I guess I'll start us out by narrowing down the search to those Cogna we're after. Sound good? Sound good. Here's the latest. Did you hear? Strange four-legged monsters closing in on Cornelia, the warrior of light, and that tough-looking lady with the pink hair. We're talking about some kind of plan to keep the threat at bay, but what if it doesn't work? I can barely sleep at night. There you have it. Nibelheim. Here's the latest. Get a load of this. Some kind of creepy machine is tearing the landscape up right outside of Nibelheim. Soldiers out there trying to take it down, but it sounds like they barely made a dent in the thing. I mean, the guy with the big sword and the young lady and the cowboy had it been able to stop it. There sword. You have it. Sword. Cloud and teeth. Here's the latest. Around Figaro. I don't know where they came from, but a bunch of strange machines have taken over the desert. One of our merchants would have died if King Edgar and the Castle Guard hadn't come to rescue. Figaro's putting up a good fight. But there are just so many. There you have it. There you have it. Tome Town. Here's the latest. They'll never believe there's been another setting in that spooky runaway train. Where does it come from? Where does it go? I'm too scared to send foot outside my door. Sid and Celeste have been racking their brains trying to figure out what makes it tick. There you have it. You sound so bored, Seraphy. Here's the latest. Where did that flying mechanical monstrosity come from? It's been dive bombing people left and right. My goodness, I just hope it moves on soon and leaves Besaid alone. Here's the latest. So, like, things are basically terrible <coughs> everywhere? That's a problem. We can't be in all of those places at once. Time! I command you to stop! Okay, can we just build time a time machine? Inside Ninewood Hills, you do realize that time is essentially stopped? Oh, wait! That girl behind the door in Ninewood Hills, couldn't she help us reach everyone? <gasps> You're right! Inside her room, we can skip around to any point in time that we want. You're right. To board the airship, all you have to do is press the. Press the. B I even discovered new mirages. Cool. Shall we get started? What now? Shall we get started? Which chip? What now? Cannon fodder achievement. Who's so... Boko has been k kidnapped! Never! Chocolate, come quick! Oh, well, hello there, Barts. What's the matter? It's Boko. He's been choconapped. It's gotta be Hyperion. He and his gang are up to no good again. What? What? So Boko's here, huh? That's amazing, Chocolate. 
I don't know anyone else who can pick up a Chocobo SOS. Oh, yes. Well, so tell me, how was Boko Choco napped again? Well, you see, I was kind of taking a nap, so I'm not entirely sure how it all went down. But suddenly, I could hear Boko quaying. He sounded unmistakably hostile, just like when we faced that black Chocobo. Wow. But I'm quite certain I would have sensed it if Hyperion was still around, which can only mean it must have been something else. Master, what is it? Huh? Bart, Boko's in big trouble! We have to go in now! Huh? What? Chocolate, how do you know that he... Hey, wait up! Hey, wait! Boko! What in the... So you're the specimen's owner. It's about time. What the? This Chocobo can talk? Huh? What are you talking about? Chocobo Galeen! Uh, no, huh? don't you see, Hey, Bart? just hold on a sec. Translated Isn't by... that the same chick that was sitting on your head? Whoa! That thing was alive? Hey, pay attention. Uh, yes, well, you could say it's alive, but... It's more like I live with it, uh, so... Stop running your traps! I'm trying to talk over here! I'm trying to talk over here! This Chocobo seems to be pretty intelligent. Makes you wonder why he bothers caring so much about his human owner. He ought to be completely ashamed of himself. And I had such hopes that he'd be a prime specimen when we Mecha Chocobos populate this Mecha world. Mecha Chocobos! Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. There's... There's... Populate this world? There's a Moogle on his chest! Now. This world's chocobos have nuzzled up to you, humans. Isn't that the most ridiculous thing you've ever heard? Isn't that normal? Humans and chocobos are... I mean, take me and Boko. We've always survived by helping each other out. <laughs> what you call helping each other, I call subjugation. Everyone knows chocobos are smarter than humans. It's time for Grimoire's chocobos to welcome the Cogna and become this world's dominant species. What are you talking about? Boko would never want something like that. That's right! And the same is true for all the chocobos out there! Huh? Who are you? Hmm. How very unusual. Why would you go and lower yourself by siding with this human? Me? I'm not lowering anything. The chocobos of this world are already perfectly happy without your help. You think being enslaved by humans is happiness? What a heap and load of phoenix down. I've heard enough. Boko here is coming along with us. You made a big mistake spying on us. Now you're gonna pay the ultimate price. It's not spying when you go and blab it all over the place. You blab it all over the place. Whoa, a robot chocobo. How cool is that? Tama, you should make yourself a robot too! Made of genuine Tamamantium L! No, Tamamantium! You should be the robot! Good idea! If we did that, then we can dismantle him whenever he gets out of line, right? Dude, you're scaring me! <laughs> Dude! You're scaring me! Unimprisonable? What the honk? I never added uh, poop sickles. Okay. I'm at a severe disadvantage right now because we don't have Tama. I am now sadness. Fix this. It just falls apart. 
Marco! You okay, buddy? I missed you too. I can't believe hey there, they wanted to rule the world with cognified chocobos. What a nightmare. That no good mecha chocobo. Yeah. I guess that explains Hyperion. I bet you that he must have been cognified by those scoundrels too. I can't even imagine. Ah! Oh no, yes I can! Oh, that reminds me. That chick perched on your head. It was doing the talking, right? Do you want to explain how that works? Ah! Oh, uh, let's just say... Oh, hey, you know what? <laughs> I've really got to get back to the shop. Do you realize what this means? I may have just found the one chocobo that can speak our language. Huh? Hey, wait for me, Chocolate! <laughs> chocobo go ching! <laughs> I love how she was just sultry walking away, just like, mm, sachet away. Are you going to touch the metal chocobo thing? Bart battles valiantly against hordes of Cogna, threatening to defense the town, but he's just one man with a chocobo. Can't be everywhere at once. There's got to be a way to destroy all these. What? Gilgamesh knows! Okay. Let's see what Gilgamesh knows. <laughs> Hey, are you all right? Uh, yes. Are you all right? I can't thank you enough. Man, since when did Grimoire get so grim anyway? Ah, uh, don't sweat it. Things will work out. The two of us can handle anything. Ah, a human who's able to defeat the Cogna. Is he a medium? Or has he already awakened? Either way, I know just what to do with him. Barts! 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 Please tell me you didn't come here to start your nonsense again. Barts! It's a target place, okay? Right now I'm busy dismantling these doohickeys. What? Barts! I have awaited this day a thousand years! Did you just add a digit? You're not getting away without a duel this time! Don't you want to defeat those... Uh, Doohickeys? Uh, uh, Coggle, Kaboggle Buggle, Kanagaboggy, whatever they Kabog are! Kaboggy! Don't know how to stop them! Kagaboggle, Nagabog, Debogga, what? What? You mean the Cogna? So you know a way to beat them? Yes! Then what are we waiting for? G-Mesh! I must have had you all wrong. G Mesh. <laughs> of course you have. Mm, do hickeys. Hey, this is far enough. I want to see this secret weapon you told me about. Yeah. Like... <laughs> I can't believe that it was easy as he said. Now that I have you alone, we can get our clash on. Bart. Huh? Who's he? Do you know a way to stop those machines, or don't you? No clue. What? <laughs> I just told you what he said I should if I wanted you to play along. Now let's get right down to the main event. True, I may not remember the finer points, but today is the day I finally picked that bone with you that I'm fairly certain I have. Excellent work luring the champion here. You've served your purpose. Get lost. Huh? What? But I haven't had a chance to settle the score with Silence! Silas. He'll meet his demise at my hands. Once they hear I defeated a champion, my rise to greater glory is all but a shame. Haven't you ever heard of keeping your word? You promised I would get to fight Bart's one-on-one. -on -one. What do you know? So that's the story. This fed head played you like a fiddle, Gilgamesh. Time for you to die! I'm sorry, Bart. Where did it all go wrong? Oh man, 
Once I've wiped the floor with these guys, you're in for an earful. You're in for an earful. We're gonna use the champion I'm not medal. Holding back against these bullies anymore. Agree. They definitely have it coming to them this time. Let's see, we've seen Shelk. We have not seen Titus or Shantoto. Let's do Shantoto. I'll deal with these bruisers, but you will owe me, you losers. <laughs> now that's the kind of uh, chick you'd love to uh, have as an ally. All right, time for Titus. Oh God, this frickin' seam. Here, I've got this. Where he just flies out of the water. All that and we still didn't even like destroy. Well, of course they do. That was a easy. All right. Victory. Victory is all but a shard. Those two just helped me out? If so, then consider me grateful. We would have had a hard time with that on our own. Now. As for you, how could you let him fool you like that? <laughs> I'm sorry. When he approached me, he seemed so keen on helping me find you. I was at my wit's end. I couldn't think of any other way to get you to fight with me. Aw, oh, come on. Why are you so fixated on fighting Don't me? Don't move, champion. Otherwise, I can't guarantee their safety. <gasps> what? No. When did he... Why if you're you truly a champion to these people, then you'll lay down your arms at once. Now, do as I say. Inkido! Inkido! What are you waiting for? Shake a leg! Uh, right. Uh, how dare you! You just got Gilga blocked! You got Gilga blocked! Take the villagers and get out of here! What about. Just go! This is my mess to clean up! A shame this is goodbye. Now I will never know the joy of dueling you! You know, he was really a tough nut to crack, wasn't he? But I thought he was all right. He was all right. Oh, I have awaited this damn million years! Birds! This time we settle things once and for all! <laughs> How many zeros do you think you could add before that sounds ridiculous? No! What do you say you and me get our fight on? Uh, no thanks. I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Poco, <laughs> let's scram. <laughs> Giddy up! <laughs> huh? Hey, come back here! Birds! <laughs> Poor Gilgamesh. He's at his wit's end. Birds! <laughs> Actually, doo -doo. 
Alright. Switching out Tidus. Okay, we've seen, we've seen. We have not seen Terra. We have not seen Yuna. We have not seen Celeste. We have seen Cloud. We have seen Bards, I think. We have seen Squall. We have seen Lightning, I think. I know we need Terra, and I know we need Yuna, because we just got those two. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't have live glitches, yo? Welcome. <laughs> what now? Whose soul will you touch? Whose soul will you touch? I don't know, let's find out. Tifa! We're gonna train center and what else makes it than a loudmouth zealot with an axe to grind. Terror is in no mood. Tifa is in no mood to assess! Time for the cognas to get beat up. Ba -na -na -na. <sighs> Home at last. I never thought I'd run into my master, let alone get subjected to so much rigorous training. You remember the flood. That was the very first sign What's of the punishment to come. The appearance of those mechanical monsters and horrible mirages. This is all the wrath of the Crimson Prophecy. And who do we have to blame for it but that heretic? She came here spouting the Azure Prophecy's lies. And now it is we who are being punished for it. She called herself a summoner, but her foolishness and blasphemy have cost us dear. You mark my- How can you say that? You can't possibly blame others for this. Oh, please, there's no mistaking it. The unbelievers have brought this upon themselves. Give me a break. If the Crimson Prophecy did turn the world upside down, there you go. What better reason not to go along with it? What did you say? How dare you ridicule the one true- oh, What kind of mirage is that? Where did it come from? S -s -s Somebody said for help! Oh, pull it together. I'll take care of this. Work? <laughs> Can't you see this is all your fault? It's here because of you! You see what happens when you side with heretics? The prophecy is gonna see that we all pay! Oh, Freva. Fine. What are you planning to do about it? What? Listen to you. All this talk of prophecies and punishment, where is that going to get you? You want to blame others for the machines? You want to blame others for this mirage? That's fine. And then, what next? Go ahead and believe in any prophecy you want. But you better like what it gives you, if you're not going to act. So, what's your brilliant plan of action then? Yeah, we saw it. You weren't able to put so much as a scratch on that thing. Only those who believe in the prophecy shall be rewarded. There will always be times when even your best efforts fail. But the courage to give it another go, that's the steel you forge destinies with. Have it your way. Go ahead and hold out hope for some miracle and let that mirage stomp all over you. But I'm not giving up. I'm defending this town. If the power's in my hands, The Mega she Mighty. Say, and she never would have pulled it off if she hadn't believed in herself. She never gives up. We could all learn a lot from her. Yup. I'm gonna start right now. Lawn Punch! That's what you took away from this, huh? Lawn Punch!
easy. What was that noise? I guess all that training paid off. How did you cause that miracle to happen? Don't diminish all my hard work by writing it off as a miracle. Honestly, you're still just a heretic. I don't care what it is you choose to believe in. But look, don't just go around fanning people's fears. Why not do something meaningful? Make the situation better. The thing about higher powers? They don't help people who don't help themselves. No way. <sighs> I suppose that's fair. So, um, I'm sorry. Oh, no. There's no need for you to apologize. With the world in such dire straits, we need to band together, right? Help from above will come when we earn it. When we earn it. Welcome to... What Welcome. Now? Who's so... Whose soul will I touch? Whoever's I want. The League of S agents spend quite a moment talking about what they want to do once the Cockney defeat a squad realizes that he doesn't have any dreams for the future and like uh, Between the Cogna and Mirages, I could really use a break. Can't wait till this is over, and I can get back to Blitzball training. <laughs> I've got my own business to attend to, as long as he's still out there. As for me, I know that once Bahamut is dealt with and the Cogna are gone, I've always dreamed of becoming an instructor. <laughs> Squall, you okay there, buddy? Don't think I've ever seen you like this. You look kind of troubled. So you... You've all given some thought to what happens next. You've got aspirations. You Ass know where you're going. Aspirations. But not me. Nothing? Come on. You must have put something on hold for this. What were you going to do with your life? I mean, once all the bad guys are gone for good, what's the first thing you want to do? Like, there can't be nothing. You want to know what I'm planning to do with my life? I never thought about it. I never so thought about the future. It. Hey, there's nothing wrong with being undemanding. <laughs> Titus just lives such a laid-back life. Is Titus right? No, it's worse than that. It's like I'm empty. I've got no dreams. I don't think I even know how to dream. All I really know is fighting. Is that what my life is? Once the Federation has been destroyed, will I no longer have a purpose? Squall! We've picked up a powerful mirage. Shulk is already en route. Can you go? Sure. I'll take care of it. Besides, it's not like I've got anything else important on the horizon. I'm here now. I'll take over. Hold on a minute. Let's team up. It'll improve our chances. If we attack Just both stay back. I said I've got it. Oh. It's a sphinx. Would you let me finish this time? If we work Just to get- Just stop. Fighting. It's the only thing I've got. I'm not like the rest of you. You've got bright futures. I won't let you get hurt. Leave that to losers like me. Mm -hmm. Then put your fears to rest. I'm like you. I have nothing to live for beyond this. I am ready to die in battle whenever that moment should come. What? But... still... Please. You just said that fighting is all you've got. If so, you must know exactly how I feel. I have no dreams. As such, I've no incentive to survive this war. In fact, I have a very compelling incentive to not survive... <laughs> so why don't we do this? Let's go out guns blazing. End it all here and now. Discharging all our magic at once would destroy that mirage. Yeah. Right. If I really thought that the world would be better off without me. If I'm 
That sad, that desperate. Fine. But I don't think that. Not enough to give up on living. No way. Mm -hmm. No guns blazing. I do have a dream. Sorry. No dying today. You know what I dream? That one day... I'll fill the world with flowers. Huh? What? Think about it. Flowers make people relax. The way I see it, they help make the world more peaceful. That does not make sense over. for Squall whatsoever. Come, come and play with me. So, don't go dying on me now. If you don't have your own dream, you can find one later. All right? Life is just Squall just precious. had like a four-hour movie. Uh. Now quit your moping. Stop dragging yourself in the dirt. And like the character thing. development in like two seconds. Shout. Did you play me? Well, after your talk with Titus, I noticed you seemed somewhat down. <laughs> you got me. Won't do it again. <laughs> yes. So, you ready? The future's waiting. It's a nice thought. Maybe we can help him plant those flowers. We could scatter the seeds from Balam Garden. <laughs> we could. Wait, we already have a meme, Coleus. Cool. Let's summon someone, shall we? Uh, Yuna just revives people and heals. Lame! Look at her go. It's such a shame, they really don't do that much damage to champions. Got doomed. Jesus Christ. Oh, we're down with the Bahydra, though. So that's Baha Nysa. You know, it may actually not be such a bad idea. Hmm? Filling the world with flowers idea. once this is all over. Cut it out. It was the only thing I could come up with. <laughs> what do you say we head back? Everyone's waiting. Oh, cool. The internet's acting up. 
Because of course it is. Do doodle doodle do. <sighs> I think I have a suspicion on why it's being so bad lately. And I'm not very happy about it. I just got a text saying that my internet has been upgraded, which means they've been doing tests and shit on it. Theoretically. I'm going to stop the stream real fast and then redo it just to see if that fixes it. So give me a seco. just died. All right. What if... Cut this down. Hmm. No, I just did a speed test and my speed up is like terrible right now. What if I did even jumping my video rate down to 3000 is like it's not stable whatsoever. Um, all right, I guess, shoot, I guess it means an early stream tonight, because I can't stream with it like this, so, it happens, so, anyway, I guess that's gonna be that, so, Sorry it ends so early. Hopefully it'll be fine later tonight. But anyway, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And hopefully until the next time, everybody. Stay fun, Capapow.